Hello and welcome. Today I'll be explaining how to crochet these cords. These cords are thinner than the normal eye cords that we make and this grows very fast. So in this tutorial I'll be explaining you how to make these cords. This is a baby pant that I have made recently and I have made a similar cord to insert here. Now I'll be explaining you how to crochet that cord. To begin making the cord, you have to keep the loose end of the yarn at least 6 times bigger than the required length of your cord. So keep the loose end of the yarn bigger 6 times than your required length and make a slip knot. Once you have made the slip knot, you will hold the yarn normally just like how you hold while crocheting. Now this is your working end that I am holding in my fingers and this one is the loose end. Now wrap the loose end around the hook and wrap the yarn, wrap the working end of the yarn around the hook and pull it through these two loops like this. Once again wrap this loose end over the hook. Now one more time wrap the working end of the yarn around the hook and pull through these two loops. You have to just go on repeating this process. Wrap the loose end, wrap the working end and pull through the loops. Only this much. This is very easy to make. So you can see within a few stitches the eye cord has grown so much. This grows very fast. And this is the best cord to make when you are in hurry. The normal eye cord with 3 stitches takes a lot of time but this one is very quick. And this is suitable if you want a thinner cord. You can make this thick by using 2 strands of yarn. Here I am working with a single strand. You can use 2 strands if you want to make it thicker. So you can see this is how the cord looks like. It is very beautiful and it looks very nice once you insert it in your projects. This is a pant I have just made. This is a baby pant and this is the same type of cord that I have inserted. It just looks very nice. Continue to crochet this cord till your required length. Once you have reached the required length, you can finish by just making a normal chain using both the strands and you can fasten off here and hide in both the tails inside this one and your cord is ready. I hope making this cord was easy for you. Thanks a lot for watching. Do subscribe for more videos.